Hey everyone, do you here at Daily Gaming back with more Monster Hunter World, and in this episode we are going to do the gathering mission for the Abalone. I can't remember what it's called. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry. It's a four star quest, it's not that hard though. Uh, what a bunch of Abalone, that's what it is. And this is a gathering mission for in the Coral Highlands. Uh, again, these, none of these gathering missions are hard to do. Don't need to worry about eating, don't need any special pre uh, prerequisite before doing it. Like, you don't need a certain camp or anything. Uh, if you want to eat, go ahead, but you don't need to. Uh, so that's about it, and I'll see you out there. Alright, so for this one, I don't actually really have an optimal path for it. Uh, the Super Abalone is, uh, or the, Ab yeah, the Super Abalone is kind of spread out. It's, I believe it's in, um, Gather from Fossils. And I know where a couple of them are at. So this is in the direction of where the Palamu usually is. I believe there's a few over here. Let's, uh, I don't think I've actually been in this direction though, so I'm just not going to show anything, unfortunately. I believe there's one over here somewhere. Maybe up above me. A conch shell. There it is. Oh yeah, that's it. It's not the fossil, it's the conch shell. Wow, we got a bunch from that. We got a choice and three supers. We actually gathered four items from that one. Yeah, it's the con shell. I know of two more. Is that one? No, that's just a rock. Oh, here's one. Yeah, I know that going towards the Palamu nest and the, the area where you find the Palamu is the most optimal path, but I don't know their exact locations. But we're already halfway done with just two. Part of that was luck, though. Excuse me. Oh, here's another one. There we go, we got eight. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. There might actually be one down there, I'm not sure. But I know there's one right up here, so I'm just going for that. There we go, nine and ten. All done. <laughs> Another quick and easy one. Like I guess I keep... I keep uh, going on about it, but I just don't understand the point of having to make these a separate mission on its own. I wonder if it's to give you a stress-free environment to explore. I don't know, but it's just pointless. I, I wish I really wish you could just do them as like a side bounty or as a ba like a bounty, just in the background. You could do it while you're doing hunts and stuff. That'd be a lot, a lot better. But there you go. There's your rewards. I'll tell you. That's how you get it done. So thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.